Sight here, unfortunately, and I don't know if the penny's dropped for Rigon just yet. No, it, it, oh, there you go. It has the bomb planted. Now they know. Okay, four over to the respond to the retake. Vinny fallen. Still standing, forcing back the Jen. Nice placement of the bullet from Rigon. And it isn't falling apart at the seams for Imperial, though the bomb is down. This late flank from Vinny is everything. If Bolts could just delay, maybe there's something to be said. They've only found one, though, and their suspicions will be drawn on the defuse. With oh, the look at the mob! And a bit of a mob <laughs> kill for security. Okay, well, I, there's a bit of an odd one. On their way up the ramp with all four right now. It is going to be an A finish. 25 seconds on the clock here. Good flash. They might want to take fights off that. Good adjustment, but FNX good on the Galil. Imperial, they're very imposing, very threatening presence. Bomb stalled out here. Oh. GXX struggling. Bomb's be going down. Five seconds. Desperate. Just have to knock him off. That's it. it. And that should be it. 2-2. Two, two. Just need the frag, and Vinny just has to watch as the time does transpire. Get in away. Imperial, it felt like they had so much to play with there. Which this time round, one for Vinny, one for Fallen, and oh. they want to take the fight, just walking on out, both getting chipped away at. Vinny's in the grave early. Yeah, it does seem like the uh, Bad News Eagles want to brawl, and we're making high evidence of that. Look at Flatro, look at the time in which he's here, at staring into the rotate. It's just going to be a Tech 9, a Mac 10, and make it just that Mac 10. Fur likely to be cleared, and not going down without a fight. One and done. But that's the 3-0 conversion. And you feel like you're blinking, you might have missed it. You can see the frags just sitting there. Good Molly's uh, smoke, that's the best they have to bolster for this attack. Swing out, the bolts again, ready to receive. Imperial still yet to buck this trend. Fully geared up. FNX gifted the orc to try and stay relevant. Latro, no issues. Tenopsy. He's just repelling the invaders. Imperial looking silly. And FNX, what's he supposed to do? Another impossible scenario dealt his way. First a 1v3, now a 1v3 with 9 AP. And that's the end of him. Nor given over. A magnanimous generation. Generation? Donate. Let's see if he can finally add a kill on the board. And oh, there it's going to be. Bullets in the back of the head. Vinny's gone. Easy. Now he just needs to get away. What well, a very effective angle, isn't it? Back turned. Vinny, none the wiser for them. Yeah, yes, could, not effective. Couldn't really do much with that, despite being close to the smoke. Far. Platro dead, surely. Success, yeah, and GXX next. Close quarters on the Orp, good for it. That's 11 and 0 for him. The Eagles are flying, soaring through this defense. On a bit of a heater. Fallen, more scout than oh. anything else. And the double nade to Sandbag mid round. Rigon. Just needs one, gets it, oh. the bonus is there as well, he adjusts, <laughs> next. see you later, Alligator, we go 6-0. Dynamic, they've got a real finger on the pulse as to where Imperial's coming from, shorts the fight, and damn, good night. Rigon, tucked in tight. And the hands of Vinny, starting their crawl now, what's, what is he up to, Flasho on the fade, okay, he's going to get cheeky with it, Fallen's posted up, oh. but he's ready. Handled. Imperial just needs to close this round off, but GXX is not to be stopped, 13. And one now, and he's lining up to delay that molly plan. Can't plan default now, it's a bit deep, a bit shy, and Sonari caught out. All onto GXX. No HP makes no difference with the AWP, and he's gonna immediately extinguish. He's gonna push through, he's playing some naughty Counter-Strike right now. Four should be set for it, does post the second, and Imperial get their first off the back of that tag time. Just off the fly nade. And it works out well. Sonari actually does go down to it, but it's still TXX finding more and more contribution. 25 HP, entire site smoked, and he goes forward on it. He wants to sweep through. He could and is set for success here. A quick one onto Fallen. Rigon still there as well, pulling the trigger, and he is racking up the frags. Vinny late mid. What's he meant to do? One on four situation. The bomb's down on the side. They already know where he's coming from right here. AWP train. Nice shot from Vinny. Needs to double up. Cannot get it. And Vinny goes on. Fall and ready to deploy. Flash and the go, and now a passive mid hold as they slink on past. GSX steps on out. He goes down, but the double ups there. Rigon saves the day. Scenario smoke just to sow some seeds of down. Rigon default. It's flat roped onto Fall and leaves already. Imperial scratching their heads. It gets worse. Fur, half health, bomb, and a low. Just a matter of time, a nice headshot to start, but way more required. Rigon double peeking, Synopsy unable to provide. 
that's the end of that. Caught staring at the walls. We go eight. Hits it. <laughs> yeah. He's not missing a lot, is he? <laughs> <laughs> 23 and 5 so far. Oh. What a, what a Hello. stark contrast from the uh, yesterday. Vertigo. What, what does I mean, this say, though, right? Does this say a lot about B&E? Does it say a lot about Liquid? Does it say a lot about Imperial? Right? You, yeah, what do you start question. to take from this game? Good question. I know it's not over just yet. Maybe, maybe they bring it back. Maybe they have a, a shutout CT side too. Right? We, we obviously have to wait and get that half play, but it's just not looking good even in the kill distribution here. Right? It, it's looking very flat on Vinny with three, FNX with three. Seven is the most for bolts. But it, you know you, you know something is, is wrong when we have... Out of VNE over towards this round, but I feel it's at least six different variations of one ways and try swinging on out into an AWP perfectly placed 25 for GXX and now. And he's already bounding off to the next point of call. It is going to be a B finish for Imperial, 40 seconds. Is there more from GXX as he has a career high performance here at the Major? There is no better feeling against legendary Major attendees as well. FNX with his 100% major win rate. Enters the site and his teammates. Good night. Can't hit FNX on the second, but GXX has done his handy work. It's FNX's away. turn. Good taps. Nade might find Flatro. Does evade nicely. Mantles up. Process of elimination dictates something similar. Can they convert this opening kill? They did find Synopsy trying to change the back. First, good for it. Flatro, low HP for the clutch. Fur allowed to get out of there. Has the kit. But I mean, a single bullet, a wall bang, he's just going to hold it. Surely, surely. That. Oh, okay, okay. it's sold. Fur gets it done. And we're having a little bit more confident right now, at least in, the, in their approach throughout. These rounds have been very spotty for Imperial, obviously, by the fashion it's only two. And here we go again. GXX, he gets the shot again, right? The flash. It's not there in time. Vinny gives up his life. The bomb now dropped on the other side of the smoke. And Oh, they just have to run on through desperately here. Flatro standing, delivering. Doesn't need to silence them four for kills towards a ramp. He just wants to see ya. My, oh my. I haven't seen a, a drubbing like this. Some time just losing these fights and taking them as well. I mean, these CTs, look at them. Charge, the cavalry does. And there, uh, FNX with just the one. 13 to 2 on the half. Imperial really are silenced so far. Almost the uh, 30 for GXX in the first half. We had this with Norvi yesterday. He ended up getting there. So both of them. Uh, that will st not stop the crawl. That was GXX. Wow, that was a quick headshot. Fur, however, keeps it level. Keeps that two-man advantage, albeit two of them very low. Oh. Nice nade onto the backpack. Scenario down. Just a third four. You can see that the CTs are happy just to let them in now. You've given them more than enough space. Bolts could have lost his life there. Things oh, are very sketchy. All he has to do is sit and wait. You know the T's have got the door locked behind them. There's a power position for Rigon, but he needs to push on in. He, he needs to usher this bomb to get planted right now. All four of them coming in from the front. Just like that. The last of four. Okay, Imperial up to five. Rinse and repeat on this sandbag spray, but he is the crawl now. Here they come. First been pulled off. It was just a deagle firing off shots. And look, backs a turn. Fallen left as well. The whole site open for business. It's just the sandbags. Fur, fortunately, good for it. It's Rigon and GXX that make a round out of this. Nice from Fallen. Rigon's deag from way downtown keeps us glued to the screen. Bomb ticket, GXX another. Double on this AWP late, puts him onto the 30, and Imperial's defenses rumble here. Just like that, it was an odd one. Aggressive until he wasn't. Yeah, change of plans. Right at the last second. And Rigon, he has got some pep in the step. Fallen steps up and deletes. Flatro. Oh, nice name. Sun on his toes, knocks the boots off of him. FNX responsible for B, and watch the GXX, you know. Perfect angle, he's on that headshot though, and it's Whoa. hard to hit. Does so though, into first forehead, just clips it through the girder and back turn. Scenario's down and whole squad trying to now commit through those smokes. You've got on Vinny. Vinny again, this time delivers. It's two and rig on now, bomb and pressure. Molly will cancel that. He gets away at least unscathed. And with that smoke still up, it might entice him to go for it again, but it's Bolt here to deny. GXX has the body, got Synopsy good for the headshot. Now the bomb's ticking. And a great shot out of Fallen for this retake. They've got kids and they've got Venom. 
ready to spit smoke onto the bomb. That will already get them a little defensive. GXX not ready for this. A fast short flank. It's FNX doing it all. The old boys. Oh. New tricks. <laughs> FNX and Fallen take it. That right there, you can see how desperate it was. How they just have to push their way on through the plank right there from FNX. Wow, they have got some tricks of their own. The uh, that was cheeky. That's I like that. I really like that a lot. Hot. It's almost as hot as the run boost onto the double stack box on B. And there goes FNX. Rig on two from that boost. That's round defining. Vinny may go uncleared. Oh, huge opportunity. He lets it slip. Butter fingers. And yeah, the Fallen and Fur duo now is completely disconnected. Man, 15 looms. I want to say might have to be a save, but I don't think they're going to let him get away with it here. Rigon now taking another. That's his third in the round. And look, we've been singing the praises of GXX, but Rigon's been having a great game too. He's up to 24 kills and uh -oh. looking for the 25th, as do it you, is actually a synopsis. He's going to knife him. He's 100% really... going to knife him. Of course, he is salt in the wound, knife in the back, body on the floor now for free. So now he just has to cross. He just has to get past this line of sight. Once the bomb goes down, now that sound cue is going to be given up. But out of position are Imperial. The three on three. Flatro is coming back in as the last linchpin of all of this. Could be the final round here. Three kills away, three clicks. And there he goes. Oh, he steps a bit far. Fallen's got a way back in. They're grouped up. It's Flatro and GXX. A good smoke used. And now pressure is on. Fallen ahead of the pack. GXX does connect. Fallen down. It's up to Vinny. Looking to come up. Clutch. And he does. Hits it just on the fake. And Flatro with that half health finishes what Bolt started. We go again. Nice clutch there from Vinny. Keep it. Got that in his wheelhouse. Oh, not today. Fallen. Pulls us back, 4v3, advantage Imperial. As this comeback has been hanging on by just a thread. Flash from the short side, this is all on flat track. Oh, bloody guarded nicely, Vinny. Comfortable in this position, it's where he's got a lot of his fragging done. Bolt will be there as well to contribute from way downtown, and it is just GXX. He was supposed to be the overwatch from Sandbags now. Probably just looking to clutch and hold on to that AWP. That's Vinny. Bolt's his foolish enough to give him anything else. Here comes Fallen. Should be in the side of the head any second now. He might even get on past here, but walking to his grave. Look at this. FNX has closed the door. There's no way back. He's just going to have to reside down to that fork room. And if he goes down after time, we're starting to get into some real issues. Imperially making this comeback work. It, it just feels like a matter of time, or at least it has until B&E would close this one out. Still, the util does to stop and cage them. Fur's actually done it with bullets. So blind, though, he has been run down. It's a big find, but look at the nade damage. They do take a big chunk out of Sunari and Flatro. Look at this gap. Look at this gap. It's He's a in. huge He's one. In. He's There's all the way in. of them. Okay. Now he's his so cut deep. noise. FNX. Oh my god, no way. <gasps> okay, that's a huge headshot. Synopsis has got the B site and the M4 pushed up. If Bolt goes down, he's done it again. Synopsy, the lurk to close. And the last two scamper over to get that bomb down. Fallen loudly. Into CT, it's Vinny through Ellie. And GXX has got CT on lock, and so do the BNE.